Marvel's Cloak and Dagger is about two teenagers that go through this traumatic, devastating event. We start by telling their origin story when they were both eight years old. They kind of go through an accident which brings them together and then tears them apart for eight more years. It's about two damaged souls who find each other. It ultimately leads to them acquiring these superpowers and also leads to them saving each other's lives. And they're not quite sure how they got them, what to do with them, and it's an incredible journey to watch them go through all of these complicated situations in their life and they get to do it together. So it's these, these two kids that end up connecting out of nowhere and uh, through fate, later on in life, they connect again. <laughs> and once they connect, they sort of figure out that they can't live without each other. I think the one thing that sets it apart from other Marvel shows is the fact that the fans are going to come for the action and, and for the visual effects and the superpowers, and they're going to fall in love with the characters and really want to root for the characters. She used to be so full of hope. What just happened? Definitely feel like this show is more character driven. I gotta go. No, stop running. Who are you? It uh, is very stylistic, and I think, you know, the way that we're developing these characters and telling their stories are from a very refreshingly raw and heartbreakingly honest place. I think we need to talk. Three words to describe Marvel's Cloak and Dagger. Wow. Um... Tyrone. Tandy. Heart-wrenching, bold, and relevant. Intriguing. Complex. Grounded. Gritty and smart. Engaging, intelligent, exciting. If I could use three words to describe the series, it would be good versus evil. <laughs> New Orleans. New Orleans grind. So damn good. Uh, <laughs> Art in motion. Rich, like in story and texture. Uh, gritty, uh, grounded, and, uh, and honest. That was nice at first. You know, these kids are gonna be able to look up to someone who isn't perfect. If your father was still alive, I swear to God, he would be heartbroken! I can't wait. I can't wait.